I mean, really, you know, the last three and a half, uh, I guess it would be three and a half games. I don't know how many, if you put that in a half, I don't know how that would go. But, uh, you know, UAB was good. We had a chance there and uh, played well for 20 minutes against Baylor. So we played some good basketball. We do need to, we knew we need to get over the hump. We do need to to uh, find some ways to step up. It's got, it needs to be a, team, a collective team effort. Um, I don't know if any one guy can do it, but when that moment in time comes in the game, uh, we got we got to be able to recognize it, make a play, and whether it's offensive or defensive, taking a charge, grabbing that rebound, or stepping up, making two big free throws. Um, uh, we need to do that. We need to we need to kind of push through here a little bit. You know, we do know they're going to come with tremendous pressure. They're going to be ready to go. They're going to not beat themselves, and and uh, they're going to be relentless in their pursuit. So um, we certainly understand those things of it. They've got. Uh, as good a front court player as there is in the league. I mean, he, he Jamal Green is, is good, and then he got some experience out there with, with Hillman. Um, you know, Knox is I, 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 I Knox is much improved from a year ago. So, um, then I like the the freshman Mitchell. He's athletic and he's getting some stuff into the game as well. So, I would say probably those are some teams like that.